what's going on guys welcome back to the channel welcome back it's your boy terabyte reacts last video i uploaded telling you guys that it seems like i pulled a muscle in my back and that was the case <laughs> seems like man's getting old you know what i'm saying i'm at that age now where i can bending down to pick stuff up and pull muscle yeah yeah crazy times <laughs> anyways i am back i'm not a hundred percent um not at a hundred percent right now as in i can i can sit up you know there's no pain there but if i move suddenly like you know what i'm saying i gotta take i gotta make sure <laughs> you know what i mean i can't make no sudden movements so if you see me trying to be a little bit careful during my reaction hopefully attack on titan doesn't surprise me because the writing has just been brilliant in this series man i don't know what's going to happen next i mean i don't know what the plan is it seems like there's something else going on here between Aaron and the other people um you know with the what they call themselves the um the volunteers right it seems like there's something going on between them and it seems like it, it just comes off that way <sighs> freaking camera man i really don't want to deal with this tonight you see how my camera just changed color just now as if it doesn't want to focus on the color that i wanted to focus on so it just decides you know what tonight you know i'm gonna give trouble let me turn on another light to see if this thing will reset okay i'm slowly getting more and more upset at this light right now so hopefully i'll be better <laughs> when the when the um the reaction actually starts i'll see you guys for the review damn it All right, guys. Season four, episode what? Twelve? Yeah. It's four, episode twelve. I think it was. Yeah. Um. Oh. I don't. I don't even know what to say when I'm talking about this show. Like some, most of the time, I don't know what to say because you can't really predict anything about. Because we thought, I thought Aaron was chilling, and now he's out. So it's like was this his plan all along you know what i'm saying like um did they i think they found out about the plan of them replacing Aaron. that's why the the jaegerists as they are calling them decided to take action against them because they're like y'all gonna switch out the one dude um that wants the best for the island like we we not with that we are not with that so um for me when i look when i look at it from this from this perspective as i said during the episode is that at this point in the story it's not even about who you're cheering for it's 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 you know what i'm saying at first you know what i'm saying i would say the first three seasons you know up until um aaron attacked marley you know we were all in a place of kill them all marley should suffer they're racist they're this they're that and we have all of these pent up anger towards marley but now it's like you know what i'm saying now it's like you're sitting back and you're like what's really going on here and what's the message that hajime is trying to you know portray through this story because it's it's not just about you picking sides and it's like you know it, it, in war there's no winners you know what i'm saying so there's only there's only losers in, in in war you know what i mean um so it's like to the point now where where you're like what is aaron doing aaron is not the same person man he has an agenda it is not being revealed to us because i think later on down the line we're probably going to learn more about what is the intention I am almost certain that him and Zeke is at a conversation already. I don't understand. 
I get it. They they have been in the same room together before, you know, under earship. We saw that earlier on in the season, you know, when we thought when we didn't know that Zeke was even working with them, you know, um, so they've been in the same room before, you know, if this was being planned, you know, and, and they have to test the rumbling, right? And that was the plan. I don't understand. They're trying to keep Aaron and Zeke apart and I get it, but he could, he could utilize the founder by by touching Historia as well. So are they keeping him away from Historia as well? You know what I mean? So there's that part of it also that I'm worried about, that I'm thinking about, that I'm like, I don't know what, what is really going on here. I'm trying to understand, but bits and pieces here. Them assassinating Zachary you know, Jaegeris, whatever they want to call themselves, is complete, it's it's understandable. I understand why they did it, right? But they are wilding out here. Like, they are doing things that, that it seems like Aaron has approved. You know what I'm saying? It seems like this was a plan in the making from the get-go for the diehard dudes like Flock. And this makes a lot more sense now why Flock is the way that he is. And I'm kind of it's kind of weird because Flack, Flock is that dude that wasn't rock. He, you know, he, he about that military. You know what I'm saying? He's about that military. Whatever is best for the island. You get what I'm saying? That's what he's going to go with. So it's not going to matter if it's Aaron is going to be the savior. You would think that he would be against Aaron because Aaron is the reason why Armin has the, 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 um, the colossal titan right you know they cried they, they fought you know flock was against it he wanted to bring Irwin back but who's to say that Irwin would have been on board with any of this jaegerist stuff you know um so did, did i don't know i don't know i don't know what to say in terms of that all i know is that I don't know if I want to cheer for Aaron anymore. Aaron is wilding. He's he's out here wilding. I want to see where his head is at and what is the what is his ultimate. I think his ultimate goal from the flashback, right, is to protect everyone on the island. I don't know what Zeke's plan is. I mean, I don't think he has revealed everything else he wouldn't have yelling a meeting with Aaron in private I don't know exactly what they discussed she said that all you know he ju they just wanted to know if he was on board with you know trying to light a mat he had to attack Marley on his own to kind of force the island to understand the urgency of this situation because we can't wait around for years for y'all to take action against Marley. You know, it's like you're taking your time digging your own grave because they uh, an attack was being planned to come back to parties as we know it earlier on in the season. They were planning to go full force with with, with everybody, all the Titans, military, everybody to go take party and then they got attacked. They didn't know that Aaron them was there, right? So there was a plan going on to go over there. And now we find out at the end of the episode that Pete and them, is, they, they're already there on the island. You know what I'm saying? So that's crazy. So there's a lot to take in, man, in that episode. Um, the, the explosion caught me off guard a little bit because, I, you know what I'm saying? Because it's like, okay, um... Armin and Mikasa is outside. And I'm like, okay, there's nobody really in that room that I care that much about. <laughs> so, you know, I didn't realize what happened until, until freaking, I was like, what's going on? Why was there an explosion? You know, that was crazy. And it happened so fast. You know what I'm saying? It happened so fast. And then 
um that the, the suspicion happened before because it's like when they were walking up the stairs to go to zachary right they um they were questioning it's like why is recruits coming from up here obviously those recruits are the ones that they, they brought the chair in it looked like they rigged the chair and the weird ass chair. i don't even know why what zachary was into some weird stuff because that chair is looks like a torture device or something from like bdsm or something <laughs> or something like that he was into some weird things and they know how to get him so it seems like they put a bomb on the chair and and freaking blew him up two other people died so three people died in the room because I, I think two people went into the room after armin and mikasa left um so that's that's crazy so pixis is now basically the one in charge and it's very interesting that conversation that pixis was having with yelena in the, in the beginning of the episode because it's it, it's like what did you guys talk about and i still think she hasn't revealed everything that they talked about because now Aaron wants to go meet up with zeke i know if both of them come together the prop the, the, the thing about it is that if Aaron and zeke come together he's able to use the fountain titan and test the rumbling or you know what i'm saying or just wake up the titans in the wall or whatever he's gonna be able to do that so i don't know i also want to know i also there's also this thing on my mind where i'm like i want to know you know what happened that made zeke change or turn back against marley you know what i'm saying like what happened because we know what he did we know what he did we know what he did to his father you know what i'm saying like ratted him out you know and you know almost got his father killed right um i don't I, I there's so many questions to be asked in this series man just following it i know all this stuff is probably you know it's, it's probably being revealed in the manga because the manga is pretty much on its uh, on the ending right now you know um and i don't want to get spoiled about anything i do not want to get spoiled about anything um so definitely you know i'm trying to stay far away even though i am like going back to read the chapters and stuff like that that they cover in this in every episode every week and it's very tempting to read past what the anime is doing it's you guys don't understand how tempting it is till i'm like um i might stop doing it I might stop doing it because it's so tempting to go forward in the in in the manga you know what i mean it's so tempting guys you have no idea you know what i'm saying because this story is just so juicy it's just so juicy you just want to know what happened what happened you know what i'm saying um i don't know i, I think i'm going to stop i really think i'm going to stop um stop doing that because i do not want to spoil myself and i want to have authentic reactions um for the anime because um i think it's better that way it, it doesn't make no sense for me to come sit down here like this knowing everything <laughs> you know what i'm saying and then be reacting like i don't know nothing <laughs> you know what i'm saying so um i think i'm going i think i'm going to stop man but there's a lot of good dialogue that happens in the in the manga that you don't really get in the anime and you guys know how i am about dialogue man i'm a sucker for dialogue like you know exposition i don't mind exposition in anime a lot of people they don't like it but i love exposition and one of the things that's important for attack on titan is exposition you know for you to understand where these characters are coming from and what are their intentions you know what are they up to and as i said i don't know who to cheer for at this at this moment should i be cheering for anybody i think at this point it is like with aaron breaking out of jail you know what i'm saying it's like what are you up to man what are you doing here you know what i'm saying um i get why he escaped you know i get why he escaped but it's but it's like you know should we still be cheering for him 
you know at this point because he just and and it looks like he just used his titan powers too so he yeah i just realized that because the the titan markings was on his eyes so he just used his titan powers I, he must have used the titan powers to get out of jail somehow some way i just remember that that's crazy so that means they didn't go and you know they didn't break him out the Jaegerist didn't break him out he just probably broke out of jail with his titan powers that's crazy bro now that i think about it of uh, he had the titan markings on his eye and then we had the scene that was shown in the trailer of him putting on the jacket you know crazy it's him and his damn man button anyways thank you guys so much for tuning in as always man thank you guys i appreciate you guys for tuning in every week watching this all 300 and something y'all that come and watch my videos appreciate it um this week we're gonna have um it's gonna be in two places for you guys this week so um i don't know why i'm saying this at the end of the video because i should have put this in the intro <laughs> but moving for moving forward we pr we're probably gonna be able to have the um the full reaction on um on the google drive and also um on vimeo so we'll see how things go anyways guys thank you guys so much like the video do what you gotta do okay you know what to do subscribe if you're new leave a comment it's your boy terabyte reacts i'm out peace